can step out Yes, I'm in now Cut your edge out To some ice broke your Hey guys, so today we are throwing away our old loofah and upgrading to Seema's exfoliating towel. This is a silver infused bamboo cloth for radiant skin. This kills 99.9% .9 bacteria and removes dead cells and stimulates fresh cell turnover. This will last you 20 times longer than a regular loofah that you have at home. It dries really fast and it is impossible for this to get mildew or odors, which is amazing. This is ideal for hard to reach areas like your back and your thighs. Just areas that you need a little extra care. This is also really gentle on your skin. This is top tier skincare right here, y'all. We fail to take just as good of care of our body in the shower than we do our faces at night every night. We think a simple scrub in the shower will do, but a good exfoliating routine will really take your skin up a notch, especially in the summer. This is 50% off on the website right now. Each towel is $19.90 and it lasts up to 120 days before having to replace it. And with my code, you get an extra 20% off. So let me know what you guys think if you've tried this and what you think. This is definitely going to be my new shower routine. So let me know. Enjoy the rest of the video. All right, y'all, this is the poster. It says, the New York Times woman search for where men get the audacity. I thought this was so funny. I was gonna um, buy this. Uh, what was the painting? Okay, I'm gonna find the painting for you guys. I was gonna buy another painting. Um, it was $300 and I was just like, I have to have it it's so cute. And then I was like, let me look on Amazon and see if I can like create my own kind of vibe which I saw this and I was like, I'm getting this because it is hilarious. Um, I cracked it trying to put it in um, with the screwdriver. I was being too rough and I freaking cracked the frame. 
which it's not horrible, but I'm just, look at her, she's so bad, like seriously so bad. But I think it looks good. It is perfect for this wall. I thought, um, I didn't want it to be too small or too big, so this is perfect. So this is the painting that I was telling y'all about that I thought was so cute. It is by Wayne Francis. Oh, I guess I could pick it. Is that like an option for pickup? That's cool. But I thought it was the cutest thing. It's so simple. Just like feminine and girly. And I thought it was so cute. But I was like, $300 is a stretch. And that's that would be for a medium. So the small is $185. A medium is like three something. And then it went up from there. Yeah, I just didn't know about it. It was just too much of a stretch for me. So when I saw that on Amazon, I was like, okay, this is perfect. And if I get over that and eventually I do want something like this, I can go for that. All right, guys, I'm going to show you guys what I got from the mall. Oh. Let me zoom you guys in a little bit. Okay, so this is Sephora. I got... This the, the okay, so I got this Rare Beauty. This is the Positive Light Under Eye Brightener, and this is what I can wear with just like some blush in the summertime. When I get tan, I never wear makeup. In the winter, I wear makeup because I need to put like some color on my face. But in the summer, I do not wear any makeup. The only thing I did not like is this applicator. It's like this metal ball that you roll on your face, which. It's different, I don't know how I feel about it. I don't know. We're gonna see whenever it comes to applying it. The only thing with this, it's probably not a big deal because you don't have to use a lot. And then I got the Hourglass Concealer in Dune and this is the Sienna. When I first tried this, I just got the travel size because I wanted to try it to see if I liked it, um, but it's a really great concealer and I actually really like it. And then this is the color in Dune that I'll show you guys. So it's kind of the same, but it's a little bit different. One is a little bit more like red undertone and the other one is more of like a pink undertone. All right, so then I got the Summer Fridays lip balm. I think this is different from the lip balm I usually get. I usually get the vanilla one. This, oh yeah, this is vanilla beige. This is different and some... Okay, yeah, this is definitely different. I haven't tried this one yet, so we'll see about that. I got this Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm Cream in color Fenty Glow. Wait, I think this is the wrong one, y'all. This is not the color that I wanted. The color I wanted was like a sparkly. Yeah, this is not the color that I wanted at all. I might take this back because I don't wear colors like this. Okay, so then I got this Sol de Janeiro 59. So this is Share the Warmth of Sunset with Uplifting Notes of Vanilla Orchard, Sugared Violet, and Sheer Sandalwood. I love sandalwood, so it's like one of my favorite scents actually, so I really wanted to try this. And then I got the um, Body Butter too, which I showed y'all, so, and I love the purple color, it's so, okay, I was too ready for that. Ah, okay, this smells nice. too good definitely a fan with the matching lotion especially for the summer this is going to be a game changer and i'm obsessed with this purple color so definitely top tier you know what i forgot to get y'all i should have gotten oil a body oil i ran out of their body oil and i should have gotten a new one I don't know if I saw it though, because if I saw it, I probably would have got it. Let's 
also this lotion is all of the lotions are for different things this lotion the only thing i don't like i hate the tops of these lotions because i can never get them closed correctly relieves dry skin repairs moisture barrier love that and need that so i just don't know if i'm going to keep this maybe i'll try a new color i'll just keep it and just go get the other one okay so on to zara so this is the batman fragrance that i got priest it is 13.90 and this smells like it smells so good this is hilarious to me it's so cute so this is the first little set that i got Comes with shorts. Oh, be careful, my love. I don't even think, okay, it didn't even say the price on here, so I don't know how much this is. Um, this is the matching top. Very cute. And then this is the, oh, I didn't know it was back. Okay, cute. This is the shirt. Don't be lazy and start moving. That's what it says. And then it comes with matching shorts. Y'all saw these when I was taking them out. I love that blue color for boys. It is so cute to me. So he has the shorts, the white shorts that were paired with this. So I just got him the white t-shirt. And these are still a little big on them because Zara, um, a lot of this stuff starts at one and a half. So they're a little big, but he'll grow into them. I thought this color, it's like a gray, like a light gray wash shirt. So I love that for him. And then that was it, y'all. So that was everything we got. Let me show you what I got from Whole Foods. When I was in line for Whole Foods checking out, my phone died and I didn't bring my card or anything. So I literally had to get out of line at Whole Foods and go charge my phone. It was so embarrassing because they were literally ringing my stuff up and the line was so long. So I was like, I literally panicked inside for a short second and I was like, oh my god, my phone is dead and I cannot pay for this. So I had to run out of line to come charge my phone. The people in there were so rude, so nasty, so rude. So, but we got our stuff. So I got some white flowers. Treat yourself, you know? I just love, like the last time I got flowers and made my flower arrangement, I just love going in my room and just seeing my flowers. It was such a vibe. And honestly, I would just like walk by and smell them from time to time. And I really enjoyed it. I feel like if you don't have fresh flowers in your place, get it and just, enjoy it like it's just amazing Ooh. i got three diapers i got him these diapers last time from whole foods because i didn't i wasn't sure which one to try you know they have real organic stuff and all all that y'all know exactly how whole foods is um they be hey. extra sometimes but i got these and i actually really liked them so I got some again, and then I got tart cherry, because I want to try to make that like sleepy girl drink. I don't know if that's what it's called, but I want to try to make that before I go to sleep, because I showed you all that magnesium that I got last vlog. So I'm going to use the magnesium, the tart cherry, and then I have that grape um, fruit soda in the fridge that I could use, so I'll pair it together, and we're going to try that tonight i got a vase for my flowers i'm gonna try this vase it's a smaller one so i think i'll like it a little bit better and i got avocados because priest eats avocados almost every day and i'm gonna start making like avocado toast and i put avocados in salads and stuff we just love avocado here so no reason to really elaborate. I got watermelon. 
We want some watermelon, baby. Here's you. You don't want this? Baby, come here. I got pure apple juice for priest. I got these chocolate covered cashews because they looked fire. I saw them when I was about to check out and I was like, I want to try these just to like snack on them and have like a healthy snack. Let's try one and see what it's in. The only thing that's throwing me off is this cashews and vanilla bean. That is kind of throwing me off a little bit. They are on something. They are on to something, okay? So good. They're a little saltier than I would prefer, but those are fire. Those make me wanna go um, back and get the chocolate covered pretzels. Mmm, mmm. I got strawberries because Freeze absolutely love, love strawberries and I put them in my smoothies in the morning. This is the last thing. I got prune juice. This is for Priest as well because he is a little constipated from switching over to whole milk milk. And then that is it, y'all. We are about to, um, I'm about to do my dishes while I still have energy and do my nighttime stuff now. Because when I get in the shower, I know I'm going to be, it's going to be over for me. So I'm going to do my nightly routine, clean up, get in the shower. Now I'm going to put my vlog together so I can start editing it as I go. Because last week, y'all, my vlog, last week was just not for me. Like, I was so, I don't know if it's because I was editing it for so many days in a row. Like, it just became so boring to me. Like, it was torture trying to get through that vlog last week for me, editing-wise. So, this week, I really need to edit day by day so I don't get to a point where I'm editing all of this content last minute because it's draining. I know I said that last week, but I didn't take it serious, so I'm going to take it serious this week. If I don't vlog the rest of the night, I will see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, y'all. It is nine o'clock. Literally, exactly nine o'clock. Um, it is time for us to get up. I have to go take priest. So I will worship. Um, to Nisi. I'm going to try to drop him off at 10 just to be a little early. I'm about to get up. I'm about to um, make a coffee and take my supplements and I'm about to wash my face, get priests together and then get myself together, which shouldn't take too long. I am tired, y'all. For some reason, I didn't go to sleep till like 1 a.m. If the only time I tell them but 
Yeah, and so let's get up. Let's get everything going. We're starting the day with Michael Todd, Transformation Church. So good. Alright. I woke up and my skin looks spectacular. Korean skincare, y'all. Okay, so this bottom one didn't last. It is in here, okay? So... Let's see what this top part is talking about. Bless you. I might just have to curl my hair with a uh, curling iron, you know, because the little heat wand that I used yesterday did not last. This looks like not a damn thing. I'm confused. No, I'm genuinely lost. My hair is just too short for them. That sucks. You know what? I'll probably have to do that with my hair damp. When my hair is damp. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do my hair so I can record this stuff. I don't think I'm going to put on makeup today. I don't know about y'all, but every time I put on makeup, I always feel like so much better without it. I don't know. I don't know if that's just me. But then when I see people on TikTok or like on Instagram, really on TikTok that have their makeup done or like YouTube or something, I'm like, their makeup looks so good. Like, I feel like I should be waking up and like putting makeup on and like being presentable. But every time I put it on, I just... I'm not a huge fan. Okay, let's get to it. Let's get to work. Good morning, Zuri.
and she let him fuck. She suck it up, make her fall in love. Put that on her tongue, perky on her tongue. She do it up, walks for us, make her one of us. Get some stuff, don't you? I just want to make a story. Don't you? Go with you. The perky I'm pulling. Valet, walk it. I'm screaming. I'm working. Then I got to play story. I'm a bird throwing party. Then 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 I'm a bird throwing party. Tried to plate this. <laughs> I, y'all, I tried to plate this, but I don't have any cups or any like round things for rice, so it came out like this. And you know, this is what we're working with. Hey guys, I'm about to go over to Nisi's place. I'm wearing this Bowen tea set. I've had this for so long, y'all. Like the letters are starting to come off of this. But I did my hair and my makeup just to like feel put together today. But every time I do my makeup, I wish I didn't. It looks good, but I always feel like I'm doing too much. But and then I put my hair in a clip. For short hair, you can like put your hair in like two ponytails and then put a clip in and it looks like normal. So about to get Greece is taking a nap. These are the glasses I'm wearing today. And I put some like little gold hoops in. I got these on Amazon. They're in my Amazon storefront. Oh. But I'm kind of hungry, so I don't know. Maybe I'll just like DoorDash something there. I'm supposed to be helping her with her business stuff. So. Oh, I have that smoothie, so I guess I'll bring that smoothie and I need to bring like a snack or something. <sighs> so let's go. We're bringing Zuri today, so should be interesting. My hair might look a mess in the back. If it does, it's okay. It looks good from the front, so that's all we care about right now. Okay, so I'm getting a snack. I'm gonna put on some spray too. My other spray is in, I just made a mess, like trying to get myself together and made a mess. What spray do I wanna to use today? Maybe we'll just use Baccarat. I never wear this. The Sol de Janeiro 59. This smells so good, y'all. Oh my gosh. The lighting is horrible. This smells so good, like, I just, like, constantly want to spray myself with this.
Hi, how are we? How are you doing? Good, how are you? Good, my name is Can you get to start off with your fingers? Um, can I do, um, do you have whole milk? Whole milk? We have almond milk. Do you want to do this? No, it's for him. It would be for him. Um, if you guys don't have whole milk, I guess just water and a Shirley Temple. Water and a Shirley Temple? Yeah, and then can I order the, um, Monto pizza and then the uh, chicken parm. You can find me with the red sauce. Mm -hmm. That's it. These avocados are literally perfect. Wow. Good job. Wash your hands. Ready to eat some fruit. Y'all, so we're on the way to dinner. We're in an Uber, which I didn't vlog my dinner because I was on TikTok Live or my um get ready with me. But why did our Uber just get in an accident? There's like a music festival in Miami. As you could see, they're both like yelling at each other. He just got in an accident. That guy hit him, and now the guy is accusing the Uber driver that he hit him, and he hit him on the side, like where I was sitting. People are crazy. Why my hair keeps doing this? Like it's taking it off. Thanks. You see how hard it's raining? <laughs> We're trying to call another Uber to see if the other Uber can get us to the restaurant. Um, but it's like, I did not get a babysitter for this. Like, I'm confused. I'm very, like, I could have stayed home. Um, so we're gonna see if the Uber will come over here and pick us up so we can go. But this is irritating me so bad. Like I should have like I should have did this. 
zona de pintura. since last night nonstop. I'm just so tired. I already drank like a little latte earlier. I'm probably about to make my second one. It is almost four o'clock and I'm just going to do like a little something. I took my lashes off last night and I don't know if I'm going to put them back on. Um, I might take a little break or I might put them on literally in the next hour, but I need to get up. I don't know. I don't know if I want to spend the day just like watching stuff and, you know, working on my vlog and just kind of spend the day in bed with Priest or what I want to do. I went to dinner last night, which I didn't update you guys, so I'll update you guys while I do my makeup. Um, I'm not doing a full face. I'm literally just doing two things. So, yeah. But I'm just hoping like maybe this will make me feel like, you know, good enough to get up and do be somewhat productive do something you know so it's not raining anymore i need to go to the grocery store and make something for lunch slash dinner i already washed my face did my skincare and I took a shower and everything so i just feel so tired i feel like going to dinner like drained me we had a whole it was a whole experience y'all i guess there's like some kind of like music festival that went on this weekend and Miami has just been so crazy and it's been raining insanely but um we still went I needed to get content for that meshki outfit and I just needed to get some content so we're like let's get out go to dinner get some content do something cute be cute you know so that's what we did but anyway let's get to this real quick I'm gonna get my um setting spray and my other stuff so give me a sec we're only using like three products. Ah! Techn well, technically, I guess. Okay, so I'm gonna set my face really quick with this Morphe Mini Continuous Prep and Set Spray. All right, so last night we decided to go to Queen Miami, which is about like 15, 16 minutes away from where I live. And 
we were gonna go somewhere like a little bit closer but we decided to like venture out and go there and they have like a dinner show and everything like that we were two hours late to our reservation y'all because our uber got into an accident the traffic was already insane so we were already gonna be 30 minutes late naturally because of traffic but then when we got into that accident, we had to wait for the police to come and then we had to wait and do all of that, which we literally just took pictures in the car while we waited and just sat there. And we couldn't like get another Uber because we were literally on the side of the street, not the street, I'm sorry, the side of the freeway. So no Uber would pick us up. Luckily the cops got there and they're like, it's only a scratch. So they just left and then we left. But the guy hit us from the side. It wasn't like anything crazy, thank God. It was not like the guy, we were in like almost stopped traffic and the guy was like inching up and hit us. So it wasn't anything like crazy. We didn't feel anything, thankfully. But we got to the restaurant, we were two hours late, thankfully. Like, thank God they, you know, let us still go in and give us a table because it was pouring rain the entire time. So we had to run inside and figure that out. We didn't get good seats. They have like a dinner show and we did not get good seats. We didn't get to see the show because we were upstairs like towards the back. So we didn't get to see it. So we had to literally get out of our seats and stand up like over the railing, not over the railing, but like closer over the glass to see the show, um, which I showed y'all. But other than that, like I wish we got there on time so we could have sat downstairs and just seen everything. It just would have been a vibe. It would have just been so fun. The food was pretty good. I got seared scallops. Um, I love scallops. My family has always made them and I just love them so much. I'm a seafood type of girl. And then we got this cream corn, which was pretty good. It's in truffle butter. It was really good. And then we got sushi. I got a California roll and that was it, girl, because I don't like to eat raw fish. I used to try it like in my younger days, but now I'm just like, no, like I just don't want to. I don't like it, it grosses me out. I don't like the texture of it. Um, and then I got this like shrimp, it was a, a prawn, so I don't know, is it pawn or it's prawn shrimp? It was um, shrimp tempura, but it was the prawns. So it's like the bigger shrimp. And it was really good, so good. The sauce was super good, it came with like this custom chili sauce so good and I would go back to the restaurant the ambiance was really pretty it was just a vibe it was really a vibe y'all know um Miami restaurants are just all vibes a lot of them have shows and like fire dancers and stuff like that depending on where you go um and the restaurants are just beautiful out here so anyways and this is Sephora's brand eyebrow pencil in taupe i like to do more neutral colors because dark brown just always ends up like being too dark for me and i always end up overdoing it but yeah so that was our experience and then on the way home we were just so ready to go home it was raining the traffic was so horrible it was just too much going on so i was just really ready to go home and lay down with priest we were thinking about doing something after, but it was just, it was too much going on. So we were just like, absolutely not. Let's just go home. Like tonight has already been an experience enough. So yeah, I got home and I took my makeup off, immediately lay down and went to sleep. Priest. Sorry y'all, Priest is bouncing. My uh, tripod is on my bed and Priest is like bouncing up and down. But yeah, I took my makeup off immediately changed and got into bed I could not wait to get home I was like I got my little content I really enjoyed dinner though um, I went with my best friend niece and her sister and I we had fun like I had so much fun I'm glad we went but I was just so we were all happy to get home so yeah y'all I'm trying to venture out and stop being so much of a homebody because I need to get out and like have time for myself even though like times I'm just like oh I really don't want to but I'm like really forcing myself so that was our experience last night 
and I woke up today at 12 o'clock. I don't know why. I do not drink anymore, y'all. Like, I just don't find a purpose for it. And every time I drink, I just feel, like, really weird the next day. And it just, like, feels like a setback for me. <clears throat> oh, my God. But, um, so at dinner, I literally just got a Shirley Temple. But I woke up today at 12 o'clock, and I was so exhausted. Like, I felt hungover. So... I was like what is happening but I'm just like maybe I think it was just like everything that happened yesterday like it was just a lot and just being out for like the first time in so long overall I had fun it was a 10 out of 10 I'm glad we went I would definitely go back okay so the blush I'm using I just used rare beauty this is in nearly apricot this blush is so beautiful and amazing and I'm obsessed with it and I need to get some more of her blushes because they are truly fire so like I said today we're just using um, I'm not even gonna set this with powder my concealer I think I was telling you guys on my tiktok live how I used this this is the hourglass concealer I used it yesterday during the day for a light makeup look and I didn't set it with powder and it looked amazing and it lasted and it was great so I'm not going to do that today I'm not going to do powder today we're just going to do the concealer blush I just contoured my nose a little bit some light eyebrow pencil and that is it I put on my lip liner uh and then this is Fenty Cream Glass in, I think this is Fenty Glow number two. I need to go get the other one that I thought I got instead of this. But this is, you know, a cool little color. I'm just kind of trying it out. Put some, let me figure this out, y'all, because I need to do something. Okay. Okay, and then I'm going to put some of this concealer. This is Rare Beauty and Always Sunny. I'm just going to put that on the inner corner of my eye. This week, y'all, I decided I am just going to tan the whole week. Me and Priest are just going to go to the pool the whole week because I need to get some color. I was looking at pictures and videos of last year, and I was so tan when I came to Miami the last time I was here. And I am so pale now, it's scary. That is it for my makeup. I'm about to, let me see actually. Okay, so I'm gonna put my hair in a bun and get myself somewhat, you know, and then I'll um, be back. Alright guys, so we're going to go to the grocery store, so I'm putting on these little hoop earrings. I don't know what it is, but hoop earrings always eat with no lashes. It just gives every time. I don't, I feel like my hoop earrings, like when I wear them, they don't look the same like they don't look as good when I have lashes on I don't know I guess I'm probably delusional but that's just how I feel so we are going to I'm gonna change Ugh, I don't know I might just throw on sweatpants on top of this because I'm literally just going to the store really quick <coughs> Okay, and then we need to put clothes on priest. So I'm about to put these. I'm gonna just throw these sweats on top of this. It's probably so humid out. I still don't know what I'm. Okay, this is cute. I still don't know what I'm making. These are big. I've lost so much weight. I still don't know what I'm gonna make, so I need to look on TikTok right now and see what I wanna make so I'm not going there with no plan. So cute. Maybe let me try to put. I always feel so weird when I don't have a necklace on. I got these necklaces from Zara, but I don't really like them. But maybe let's see how. But 
this is giving pool day and I love that. Tomorrow, hopefully it's like sunny tomorrow. Winter comes in town on Thursday so I know we're going to do a lot of festivities. I'm excited for her to come. And... Okay, this is cute. I don't know why everything looks different with outlashes. But... This is cute. It's definitely giving, put your bathing suit on, we're going to the beach. Love that. Okay, so I just put myself together real fast. Y'all, that was like 10 minutes. And I look so put together in a minute. So, add a little spray. I don't know what shoes I'm putting on. I'm probably just going to throw on some sandals. So, if you guys can tell, when you just put on concealer and then, like, blush, and you don't add anything to your forehead or the rest of your face, really, it makes your skin look so dewy and just, like, healthy and amazing. Like, you just glow because your skin, like, you don't have makeup all over your skin. So... Y'all know I love a good perfume combo. I'm going to do this. Um, this is the Ariana Grande perfume. I don't know what this is called, but it's the vanilla one, and it's the white one. She has a white and a pink, which I want to try the pink, but it smells so good. And y'all know I love Ariana Grande. And then I'm going to use this, of course. How aesthetic. Look how cute. I should be going somewhere. This looks too cute to just go to the grocery store. Like, it's just effortless. Okay, guys, I got stuff for Chili. Let me go get my slippers. Okay, anyway, so I got stuff to make Chili. Because I don't know what else. I really didn't know what else that I wanted to make, and that just sounded really good. I also got um, some mail I had, which I ordered these non-stick pans because every time I make creased eggs in the morning, um, they stick to the pan real bad and I absolutely hate cleaning it. So I refused to make him eggs until I got a non-stick pan because it's too much of a headache. Okay, so that is what we're going to do. I'm also going to show you guys how I have been making my um, lattes because they've been so good. And um, I feel like so bougie and grown. So I put down my coffee maker because it has been up. I don't know why, but I've been really into when I've been going to restaurants since I don't drink anymore really. I'm um, not really. I don't drink anymore at all. Yeah, I have not had a drink. So I'm just going to use the cup I had earlier. I have not had a drink, y'all, since before Jamaica. Because y'all remember I couldn't drink in Jamaica because I was getting my boobs done. So I didn't drink before that. I couldn't drink for like 30 days before my surgery. So I haven't drank since then at all. Like not even a drop. So since I don't drink now. Oh, I have to add When we go to a restaurant, I'll get a latte or I'll get like a Shirley Temple or something like that. And every time they give you a latte at a restaurant, it's hot. And it has been such a great experience so i've been into my lattes Fuck. i've been into hot lattes so that's what i've been making and i've been frothing my milk with a little thing that i'll show you guys that i got from bloom a long time ago, but it comes in handy
Get out of there. Thank <laughs> you. 